Hey kids, it's Coach Gav from Five Steel BC, and today we're gonna do passing. So make sure you've got your passing partner. Let's go. Now, guys, we're gonna learn the technique of doing a pass and receiving the ball. So you're gonna catch as well. So we need to make sure, firstly, we've got our feet shoulder width apart, and we've got our knees bent ready to catch. We do not pass unless our hands are out to receive the ball, okay? So when we're doing that pass, if we're doing that catch, we want to make sure we've got a W, okay? So look at that W when you're passing and catching the ball, okay? So we're just gonna practice doing that for a second. Here it is. Super important using those thumbs when we're passing that ball. So remember this, we're going step out, hands out, thumbs out, okay? So one more time, we're going step out, hands out, thumb out. Go for it. Now guys, we're gonna add in a ball and we're gonna be three big daddy steps away from our passing partner. And we're gonna practice that passing technique we just learned just now. Let's go. Right guys, that was too easy for you. What we're gonna do is we're gonna take what we've learned and turn it into a game. So firstly, I want you to pick any animal you want, okay? We're gonna choose horse. And the aim of the game is to not drop the ball. If you do though, then you gain a letter of the animal you chose. The winner of the game is the person with the fewest letters of that animal. Give it a go. Hope you liked that video. If you want to try anything else in basketball or you don't know how to do it, please just comment down below or message me and we can try to figure something out. Have fun and challenge yourself.